Okay, we got another pole position one repair. So this CPU, or I'm sorry, this video board was bad when I first powered it up. The CPU board came up, but upon doing what I like to call a tap test, it would actually uh, sometimes lock up, sometimes it would reboot. Ended up being uh, two bad sockets, one under an 06 and one under an 08. This video board, on the other hand, had no sync. Uh, my monitor, the with no sync, this picture would just go black. On an arcade cabinet, it probably just would have shown a bunch of garbage that you couldn't lock into. That was that 107 right there at 11B. Yep, 11B. So that 107 had to be replaced, and I got sync, and then when I powered it up, the screen was all white. And there was like little colored blocks, like yellow blocks and pink blocks, where some of the text was supposed to be. And that was this socket here. And not only was this socket bad, but when I pulled this O2, the original one that was in that socket, when I pulled it out, a bunch of legs broke off in the back end. So I just replaced that O2 as well. And as you can see, it's up and running. All the inputs work. I'll go into test real quick so you can hear the some of the sounds. I can't do this with one hand. Hang on. There we go. But yeah, so that is one video board, one CPU board, and another video board behind me that works so far. Those are all pull one. I believe the other three are pull two. I don't know for sure. Be right back.